week is 4th of July, and I've got a really easy dessert that I think everyone will be really impressed when you make it. It's a watermelon cake, but there really is no cake. It's just watermelon. So I've got a watermelon here. I've kind of cut it in half. And what I'm doing is I'm taking off this top part, too. And you, you kind of have to treat this like a pumpkin in a way because cutting something round is not always easy. So I'm getting this top portion off. And of course you'll want to eat that later too. But this is essentially your cake. So you want to go ahead and get it on the plate that you're going to serve it on. And then take your knife and go ahead and cut the slices because you're going to decorate the top. And you can decorate whatever you like. I've seen pictures where um, people just put the melon balls. Like if you have a melon baller, ball out the rest of your melons here and you can decorate around the top of your, your watermelon cake with that or you can do different berries, you know, whatever you like. So you got all your slices and then just go ahead and push it back together so that it's cake-like again. And then I'm going to put some whipped topping on top. Just kind of get that around. This will kind of hold my berries in together. And then just decorate the top. And this is something that you can make ahead of time and have ready for whenever you finish eating all the hot dogs and coleslaw and hamburgers and everything else and then bring this out. You might want to put this in a, over a bowl or something because the watermelon may seep on you just a little bit and it's something that everyone will enjoy because you have to have watermelon for 4th of July. So you can find this recipe in Wednesday's flavor section of the Tyler paper or on CBS19.tv. Have a happy 4th of July.